in the previous video we talked about the intro now we're going to talk about the body i'm going to show you some things that people put in a contract and something that you need to keep in mind so if you look at here we talk about the intro in the previous video so we talk about the intro and now we're going to talk about the body and what you can find in it so we talk here about the intro and this is the body and this is the outro so most time when you start with the body you have the first article and it will go all the way down until people sign so all the way here until the outro so if you look at here if you look at here this is one example when you have this contract how you're gonna sell the computer software and what needs to be done and it's important to know in a contract what are you going to sell so you need to make a good description of the software what is it exactly and how much people are going to pay for it so you see in the first article they talk about purchase and sales what is the software exactly um, where's the copyright in which country and then you give a description of it and you see here registration number if it's registered as a copyright and all those other stuff and then here, what are, what are you allowed to share and what are you not allowed to share, those kind of things. So technically, the basic stuff of things that you need in order to sell software, you will put it in here in the first article, but you need to make sure that you know exactly what the software is. You see, sometimes people, they they uh, they get, a, um, they get an uh, agreement online and then they fill it in, but they do not write exactly in the agreement what is the software? So the software, if you're looking on the description of the software, most of the time it's not exactly what is the software. And the problem with that is when you sell it and something goes wrong, people are going to ask, okay, did you sell that or not? Or did you buy that or not? And that's why it's the description of this really important. And about the license is also important because when there's no agreement about the license, most of the time the law will go first. And the law says the person that created has the copyright and they can decide what they're going to do or not as long as it's within the limitation of the law. And that's something you need to keep in mind. So people underestimate the agreements. I can understand that sometimes because they don't have the money to pay for it. But when something goes wrong, it goes wrong. And you don't want that. So in a contract, you put these kind of things in it and shareable software. Okay? Delivery, so how are you going to deliver it? What kind of documentation do you need to give them? Do you give them the source code? Do you give them a uh, disk with uh, every program on it? Those things are really important, and most people don't see the value of that. And that's sad. Seriously, that's sad. So, in my opinion, if you are creating a software and you want to transfer it to someone or you want to um, sell it to someone, make sure you have an agreement. Make sure you describe exactly what you're going to sell because that's really important. So if you like this video, subscribe. Seriously, subscribe is for free. And you can also like this video. And if you appreciate this information that I'm providing you and you want to support us, you will find the donate link in the description. Press it. Donate something, even if it's something small. It will help us a lot. So I hope you guys like this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.